risen since the uh, since the last offering, but they they got near to the top end of what they wanted to auction uh, across all three or four lines uh, away. Demand, as you were saying, was was okay at the at the three and thirteen year, but at the long end, which was a, a cheap part of the curve, and the issue itself was was cheap within that uh, within that area. Demand was pretty good. I think the cover was just under two. So a lot of that was from uh, from domestics. So I think that the Italian authorities can take some heart from that. All right. Um, do you think, in general, we're getting a little bit too exercised about rising yields in Italy and Spain? I think the signals from this auction today were were very encouraging, and maybe. Um, the political uh, jitters that we're seeing in the market or worries have, have been a little bit uh, overstated. I can't help feeling though that given the, the, the tightness of the polls just ahead of the, the blackout we saw on, on Saturday is, suggests to me that there will be some upward pressure on yields um, over the next couple of weeks into the, uh, into the elections. I think the problem is that you know, at the back end of last year, we saw a big yield grab for peripheral debt. We saw a lot of um, overseas interest again. And I think the investor positioning is going to leave the market vulnerable to a little bit of selling pressure uh, into the elections. So, so what is ICAP's trade now? Is it, is it keep, keep, uh, keep long the, uh, the core sell periphery? For, for the moment, yeah, particularly at current levels, we would be sort of staying long the core, um, uh, short the periphery, looking for wider spreads going into uh, these elections. I think 10-year Italian yields will end up over the next couple of weeks being a little bit closer to 5% as, as, as we go into the election. And if we get a Bassani Monti win, will you reverse that trade? Yeah, I think so. I mean, if, we, if the outcome is um, in line with uh, expectations in, in, in the market in terms of, you know, a Bassani... Um, uh, a Monte uh, coalition, then I think that's going to leave room for uh, Italian yields to recover some lost ground and spreads to narrow again. So at that point, we'll be looking to get along the periphery, short the core.